Welcome back to the channel that strives to get your life skilling adoration. My name is Teddy for all of you who are new and for those who are coming back I hope your week in Black Desert has been fun. Alchemy always demands more and more ingredients and gathering can make a lot of money. So today I will be running around the loopy tree forest sapping as many loopy trees as I can. So grab a cup of coffee or a cup of tea for my European fans and let's just jump into this. Coming out here to Kama Sylvia, there are plenty of loopy trees all around the region with loopy tree forests having the largest amount. But why am I collecting loopy tree sap? Because I plan to make a lot of those spirit perfume elixirs to make a ton of silver on the central market. Besides, collecting the sap from the loopy trees out here gives a chance to obtain dead tree essence which is also needed for the elixirs so it kills two cuckoos with one stone. So now that you know why I'm out here, let's get all buffed up and ready to start gathering. Starting at the end of the ash forest, I will make my way towards the Fattus. I don't want to get too close to them since their archers hurt in gathering gear. This is not going to be a way to get all the dead tree essence needed, but it will provide a large portion while collecting the sap. I've done this a couple times a week and I've made at least 600 mil before I've wasted 400 mil on light stones. You know, I'm still trying to get that stone. While I'm out here gathering, drop down below and let me know if you like to collect loopy tree sap or if you just buy it off the central market. I personally try not to use the central market as much as I can. While you're down there, be sure to also hit the subscribe button and turn on the notifications so you know when I have a new episode out. If you're enjoying the content, be sure to also smash that like button. All your support is greatly appreciated back to gathering, I can get a nice amount of Kaffirs out here which is good if you're trying to make that extra money. Between this and the moss trees, I'm not sure which one I like more, they both drop the same dead tree essence and their sap. Which one do you prefer? I will have to switch channels so that I can keep going. My storage maids are ready just in case my weight is going to be a problem. I doubt it will, but just in case, I will be tossing out all my trade items, of course. Who needs them? After an hour, though, here's what I was able to make. But to keep with the normal here on the channel, let's keep going and see what else I can gather. After spending all my money on my last Tri Manos ring, I need to start working on replacing my Duo Manos rings with Tri. Last episode I got a little too low on my energy for my liking and I want to prevent it this time. I made sure to keep an extra blue grade life spirit stone on just in case the one I'm using breaks. This makes sure I can keep using my cons heart later on this week. And don't worry, I've been working on trying to build my sharp life stone alive since I won't be getting one off the central market anytime soon. But with my meal coming to an end, it's time to head back to Grana and start listing all of this to see how much it makes. Now that I'm back in Grana, let's start selling everything. The loopy tree sap makes a nice 86.4 mil, but it's the rare drops that'll make me more money. The hards make about 6.4 mil, while the sharps make 14.4 mil. Dead tree essence makes a nice 39.4 mil. I only got one black gem fragment, not making it worth selling. After making all the kaffirs, I was able to make a great 105 mil. This all comes out to about 251.7 mil total making this a fun and easy way to collect the ingredients you need and make a lot of money in the process. I plan to keep coming out here until I have all the ingredients needed to do alchemy later. There are of course other ways to make silver and when paired with this can speed up making certain elixirs. In the meantime if you want to see another way to make money in Black Desert Online or just want to see how to speed up those life skills Click on this video here and I will see you on the next episode.